Oh my God. One waft of air the wrong way. It could be a total disaster. I'm Zena Roberts Rossi, I'm the E News fashion correspondent, and I am here with In the Know. I love this. I mean, the wig though. This is not even a wig, this is a piece of art. It's literal heavy crystals on her head. I would look like I was wearing a mop on my head if I did that. There is like 80 steps up to the entrance of the Met Gala. That is no easy thing to figure out. If you're lucky like JLo, you have A-Rod by your side to help lay out to look. Those things do not fluff themselves. The first look at the Super Bowl, I even fell off my chair. We knew we were in for the best halftime show of our lives and the fact that this skirt was detachable and she just peeled back the layers from there throughout the whole show. And it was Versace, and it took 900 hours to make, and it was a baller. September 2019 will forever be ingrained in our memory because JLo came back in that Versace dress. The dress that basically started Google Images. The dress that we all stared at. The dress that we still all stare at, and we're still all staring at her body. And how did she come back looking better so many years later, he killed it, JLo. I was a big fan of JLo's Valentino dress. I thought it was beautiful. I liked the idea that she was just a giant bow. We're seeing so many big bows on the runway. I don't think she looks anything like a Christmas present. And if she did, what a great Christmas present. This coat was the heart of the story when it came to Hustlers. The, it was symbolic in the fact that when she sat on the roof having a cigarette in this massive fur jacket and Destiny comes in, she literally takes her under a wing. I mean, who wouldn't kill to have JLo wrap their fur around her? It was when you used to watch the film and you're like, is she a goodie or is she a baddie? 